This is the 95th first day of school for the Palm Beach Day Academy, and the Civic Association was there to see the opening. What was it like this morning when your mom and dad woke you up? I was a little bit nervous. Oh no, the first day of school. I was very, very nervous. I don't really know what to expect, but I think that the teachers will be great and I'll have a great year. And what about their concerns and goals? I'm a bit apprehensive about the change from 6th to 7th, but I think it'll be a great year overall. So putting nerves aside, what's your favorite thing about Palm Beach Day Academy? Um, everything really. All the teachers are really nice. Well, what I like about Palm Beach Day that I think sets it apart from other schools is the toughness of like the curriculum and how good the teachers are. The academics are phenomenal, sports are great. I've known my friends in, for most of my life. And this year I actually have Mr. Greco and he, I can't wait to complete a speech unit that he's like a legend here at Palm Beach Day Academy. And I just wanna finish out strong. Mr. Greco is indeed a legend at the Palm Beach Day Academy and his goal for the last 48 years is to make each student into a critical thinker. To be a critical thinker, you must be a good writer, a good reader. You must be objective. You must be fair and you must be courageous at times. We also wanted to find out what the parents think. Every day when our daughter comes home, we know she's been loved that day by her teachers and given every chance at excelling in her education. What's the best thing about the Palm Beach Day Academy for you? Just seeing how Harrison's grown and developed and matured and the support, you know, that's given by the teachers and, you know, the, the entire staff and faculty here is fantastic. What is the thing that you love most about the Palm Beach Day Academy? Well, what don't I love? It's just, you know, home for my kids and the teachers are amazing and the education is not to be beat and we're so lucky to have it on the island. This is also the first day for the day school's new upper school division head. I really want to know these students uh, and not just, hi, how are you doing? Them. That's why people bring their children here. But also reminding us ourselves it's 2015. There are a lot of different learning styles, teaching styles that we need to just make sure we're aware of. I want the students to leave here in eighth or ninth grade uh, with tech tool belts. I want, to, I want to know they have 20 different tools when they walk into a high school classroom or a college classroom and they're ready to go. There you have it. School has started and the Civic Association wishes the students and staff a great school year.